plaintiff, LaWanda Nash, started dating the defendant after they met on a website, and she thought he was a nice guy. But she soon discovered he was nothing but a womanizer. LaWanda claims the defendant was using her car to meet other women, and she's suing him because he got a ticket and then got the vehicle impounded. Defendant David Joyce says he's a church music director, and he also teaches Chicago-style step-in. David insists there is no proof he was driving LaWanda's car on the night the traffic ticket was issued, and therefore he refuses to pay. Start with you. Okay, oh, first of all, I can't contain myself right now because I'm here with you, but... Oh, okay. <laughs> you should thanks hope they for, record that. Yeah, thanks for the admiration. <laughs> What'd you say? Hope they record that. See, that's right. <laughs> say it again so everybody can hear it. That's right. <laughs> No, thank you for the compliment. <laughs> okay. Well, me, where are you uh, from? Dallas. Okay. Mr. Joyce, me and him had a very short relationship. We seemed like it was a very long time. Okay. I'm going to leave that alone. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. I met Mr. Joyce on a dating site. I thought, okay, he's a very nice guy. He plays the organ in his church, and he's all, he also has his little production company where he teaches the Chicago Step. Uh -huh. So I'm thinking, okay, nice guy, everything going good. Come to find out, no, he's a womanizer. I'm not, that's, and how, that's not true, y'all. How did you come to that's, discover that? That's not true. I come to discover that because of the things that he would do to me and that I found out through text messages that he does to other women. Watch out. <laughs> that's not true, you know. That's not true at all. Short. In a short time frame yes, I'm talking about. Very short. That's not true. Uh, yes. <laughs> I'm gonna leave it alone. Yes. Man, she giving me so much ammunition. Yes. But I'm gonna be nice because you seem like a good guy. I appreciate that, sir. You seem like a good guy. Appreciate You're that, just John. filling me up with ammunition. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. Um, he was meeting other, he was actually conversating with other women, and he was also meeting women while in my car. Oh, mm -hmm. And when you uh, mentioned it to him, what did he say? I didn't mention that to him. He's I just, just kept now that to finding myself. out? It's yeah, me, just so now he's finding he's out. Well, what face. did you mention to him? You say he was a womanizer. What did you mention? I mentioned the fact that um, how he would pick me up late from my job, in my car, how he um, would get upset when he pick up my keys, want to go somewhere in my car, get upset about that, have an attitude. But how did all that equal cheating, though? You catching him cheating. You know, he could have been doing anything being late all the time. He could be a crackhead and he's still smoking his crack <laughs> instead of picking you up on time. He's not a decent enough guy. But, sir, why didn't you have a car? You give me some background. Well, Your Honor, um, I'm, I'm, I'm a very busy person. I'm a... Like, that's like, why like, you were late. That's, that's why I was late, because I'm busy all the time. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a, Like she said, I'm a church music director and I'm a Chicago-style stepping instructor. So then I, you I'm got that busy. other business, that nighttime That's right. Business. I'm, I'm, I'm going. I'm going, Your Honor. I'm going all the time. I'm the first one there, last one to leave at both of my positions. Yeah. I'm, I'm dealing with a lot of women because in the church? ballroom work with my church. Mm -hmm. My church is called um, Lively Hope Missionary Baptist Church. In so Dallas, church. obviously. It's outside of Dallas. Okay, outside, outside of, of Dallas. Dallas area, yes, yes, right. Your Honor. You keep but, moving up. You'll uh, be over there at Jake's in a minute, right? I'm, I'm hoping to. <laughs> be over there Jake's at do, Jake's. They musicians do pretty good over I, at Jake's. No, you're not going to take uh, my man's job. <laughs> uh, my good yeah, buddy, Fred Hammond. Yeah, I know him very the, well. Uh, all right, you know yes, Fred, sir. so you know you're not taking that job. Fred no, is the best gospel uh, artist out there, if you ask me. Male gospel artist, him and then Donnie McClurkin. Yeah. When I say then, because they're gonna Fred retire and I one day, to school together. Yes. Yes, sir. So They're going to retire one day, so All right. I can then slip you'll in. step in there at Jake's church. That's right. All yes, right. Sir. Yes, Sean. And so um, you're doing both things, and you're a productive young man. But what about a car? I'm just curious. But but because the issue about the car, car, Your Honor, like I said, Your Honor, I'm I'm always going. I'm I'm out late because, of course, and when you're dealing in the stepping world, I teach and I promote. So why, did, so why didn't you own a car? That's what, what I'm asking. I was in the process of getting a car. What happened to the last one? 
The last one, the motor went out in it. Uh, a lady hit me and it messed up the motor. How long ago had that been? About a year, you know. All right, so you got a... bad credit. No, I lost some credit's not bad. <laughs> I just didn't never get around to it. No, no, you didn't get around to it because well, you got well, bad Yana, credit. Well, Yana, you Nobody know Nobody goes it. without a whole year with all these obligations <laughs> you have, running here, running there, running here, well, if you I, have I, an opportunity to get your own car. Well, I, you got I have bad the bills, credit, Yana, I have and that's bills. why you don't have it. <laughs> I, I got the bills, one of them 400 John. numbers. Yes, sir. They say, what's your credit rating? 410. <laughs> That's a little higher than that, Your Honor. It is? Yes, sir. It's a little higher than about, that. About, about 600. All right. Then you should be able to get your car. I got one now. All right. Well, then you wouldn't <laughs> be in trouble if you had one when you were with her. How does he owe you for a traffic ticket and impound fees? My car got towed when he, was, when he got arrested. And, and the what ticket... What was he arrested for? Well, he told me he was arrested because it was for tickets. Okay. And so... And I was had, on my way to buy another car uh, when I had no car. Uh, and you uh, incurred the expenses of $268 for both the impound fee and a traffic ticket? Yes, sir. All right. Yes, How did Honor. the traffic ticket uh, come to your name? Because uh, I'm... It's, I, the car is registered to me. They didn't stop him, though? If they stopped him... No, he ran a red light. And gotcha. It took a, okay. Yeah, and it took so a it was picture the camera. of the light. Yes. Got it. All right, sir, what do you say to this? I don't, I don't have any recollection of that, Your Honor. I don't have any... It could have been somebody else driving their car at that time. If the camera got him, I wasn't on the camera. So it could have been Is somebody... Is that true? How do you know it was him? Because right here, he had a... Com oh, can you pass that to the judge for me? There was a convention that, through his production, that um, he was in charge of. So he had to been in that area in my car. Okay, and he had your car today at a convention. Yes. Sir, is that true? No, sir, that's not true. Okay. Uh, you have that's the ticket? That's not true. Yes, I Evidence do. Evidence of the ticket, because that'll show me. I have the flyer here. We'll see if it's the same day. We'll see if it's true. I know you good church man. You've been church, church. I want to be in the church choir. <laughs> I want to lead the choir. Oh, yeah, I'm trying to move up to Jake's. Move I'm up. trying to do this. Move Fred up, Hammond, I'm going to be like him. Don't move up. You ain't gonna be like them lying. <laughs> you gonna go to hell. <laughs> I'm not going there, y'all. I'm not going well, there. She might tell you that today. <laughs> no, but I refer to Judgment Day. All right. Yep, indeed it is the same date, sir. <laughs> but what you all so late for? It, Your Honor, these events last pretty late. Yeah, uh, one, all two, night sometimes three sometime. and we, 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 we dance, we have a good time. We all step and have a good time. All right. So they, a lot of times we are late. All, night. all right. Judgment for the plaintiff. It matches the date of your event. <laughs> matches the date of your event. And you have her car from time to time. So in this instance, I'm going to agree with her. Have a good day. Judgment for the plaintiff. <laughs> Said he knew me one day, you don't know me. She was a nice person. I don't have anything bad to say about her, but a lot of things she said wasn't, wasn't accurate, wasn't true. But it is what it is, so.